With the awkward moments behind us, we begin our day-long journey into the wilds of Molten Forest. With the combined forces of me, Tosh Bates, and a guest member of the Monster Quest team, we're completely safe against any cryptid attacks. But what will protect us from each other? Look! There seems to be a mysterious disturbance over here. Not super cobra trail. How can you tell? <clears throat> Look at these cuts. Only something as sharp as a chupacabra claw can make that clean of a slice. No, this disturbance is clearly the claw markings of a bottomman beast. How could this be a bottomman beast? The bottomman beast is a feline and lives in Bodmin, England. It kind of looks more like the markings of a chainsaw. Shut, Shut up! up! Wait, we can use the creature evidence scanner to solve this history. <sighs> of course you have one. Data. Loading. I'm telling you, this is from a bottom and beast. It is obviously a mutated chupacabra. I've already encountered 57 instances just like it. And you never once just took a picture? That is not how Destination Spoof works! Well, how does your show work then? Holy sh! Oh my god, what was that? Oh my god! Oh my god! It was just a bird. That's it? What even makes you qualified to be a monster hunter? Well, if you must know, I am a registered snorkel diver, and I have summited the highest peak of Mount Paco in southern Mexico. How does that prepare you for catching monsters? What are you going to do when you catch up with one after chasing it? Well, I'm, I'm going to catch it, and, and I'll present it to the official board of zoological studies, and they'll finally accept me as a cryptozoologist. And how are you going to catch it? Uh... Do you have any skills in, like, hand-to-hand -hand combat? No. A giant net? Anything. But what's better than Monster Quest? You guys just send your little, little gadgets out to do the dirty work for you. Hey, this is a perfectly professional and accepted way of capturing creatures. <laughs> now we will come back in three to four days to see if we got anything on film. What the hell was that? What the hell was that? I, I don't know. A bird? I think it's over there! I can see it! No! No! Wait, we need photographic evidence of this creature! There's something alive over there! It's very large! I don't know what it is, but I'm going in! And now for any commercial break. You know, this whole time, you've never revealed yourself to me. But now that you have, I think I'm falling in love. In spur rational. UFO sightings have dramatically increased during the last two months in both the western and northern Molten districts. Oh! I, I, I think I sprayed my ankle. Oh, oh the data's finished loading. Let's get it out here. Oh. We're gonna finally figure out what this monster is once and for all. Loading has been completed. Result. It was a deer. Ah! It's always a deer for some reason. Uh, a deer did not make this. I like Tasha's theory better. This means we must commence mission phase part two. After devising an ingenious plan in my head, I've set up a base camp at a height of ground level, with the others posted a few hundred meters around camp as lookouts. We are keeping in touch with the use of high-tech walkie-talkies. However, I just can't shake the feeling like this whole thing might blow up in our faces.
Hey, I don't see anything. Neither do I. Hold on, gang. I'll see if I can spot him with my thermal glasses. In digital 3D. Oh, but I'm too techy for him. Good news! There's nothing. Do you mean the creature's gone? No, no, I mean there's literally nothing. It's 93 degrees over here. I, everything is just coming up red. Let me see if I can tone down the setting. There we go. That's much better. Oh. Oh my god! Tosh? Tosh? Paul, have you heard anything from Tosh in the last couple of minutes? No, I think he deserted us. Destination Spoof might have ditched you, but Monster Quest will always be by your side. Uh, I, I actually think Destination Spoof is. <laughs> I saw monsters! I don't like monsters! Where did you see it go off to? It went that away. Come on, let's go get it. I don't wanna! I'm scared! Do you think all your female viewers will enjoy watching a scared weakling on their screens? Or do you think they'll enjoy watching a bold adventurer? Follow me! For I am a bold adventurer and I know where the beast hath gone!